thing's nice. <laughs> I know, I like it. Well, this morning we're showing you this Ad Motor M65X that we got. And uh, we've rode mountain bikes for years, still have some. But uh, why we got this is because we're not as young as we used to be. Uh, you can ride this thing and it's electric assist, but you can adjust it where you put more pressure on your legs so it gives you good exercise. Uh, helps us with the steep hills that we live in around here. So Cinda's gonna take this and use it to run errands and uh, you know make deliveries to the post office. Uh, it's definitely gonna save gas by using it. And uh, we're gonna uh, even save a little more by using a solar panel and a Pecron generator that we have and uh, charge it up and use the sun as power. So Cinda's gonna take the bike and, and get used to it riding around here on some of our little trails. And uh, like I say, get used to it. And then we're gonna take it and uh, ride it down to the lake and uh, ride around there some and show how good it does on the hills. Cause there's some steep windy hills going to, to the lake. I think she's liking it. Here she comes. She's flying through the trees. That's a nice bike. I don't know if I'll see her again. That's pretty steep. She's doing good. So, so far, some of the features that we really like about this is the disc brakes and how well they work. Might zoom in on it. So you can see the nice disc brake, good size uh, disc. Then you got your uh, cable disc here that's run on a cable. It's not hydraulic. Some of them are hydraulic, but these it really didn't matter. These to are us. mechanical, and they, but they still work really good. Yep, they stop you, man. You can. You got to be <laughs> careful with this. And while we're up here, you see that it has a really nice little headlight, and that's all wired into the battery. So um, if you drive at night or whatever, it has a reflector also. Well, guys, it's, it not only has a headlight, it's got a tail light, and it's got little turn signals right here. When you turn them on, I mean, hit the turn signals so people can see it. And brake lights. Brake light also. Yep. So that's fantastic. And this little uh, backrest... Uh, this is extra, so you can get this, or you can get one like this that, that bolts on is just carrying stuff. You can kind of carry stuff if you're just by yourself with that one, but you can get either one of those. So two nice extra options that you have to buy without the bike. Yeah. Another thing you notice, it has, uh, this is full suspension bike. You can see the front forks, and the board, they, they work really nice. Uh, for going off-road you can see your back shocks too they're actually an air shock also you can put a little air in here with spring assist uh, it's got your back pegs for your second rider on both sides and nice fat tires it'll go over so yep. far it we can go off-road with it and it does really well 
Um, and, I, and I like the, uh, you're able to shift. It's got seven gears, just like a regular 10 speed uh, for going up hills, or you can get it into a higher gear for going downhill so your pedals aren't, you know, going real fast. And another nice feature is the battery system here. Uh, it's got a 960 watt hour battery. And uh, also the uh, motor back here is a 750 watt motor. So you got all kinds of power. It'll pull me and send up hills and, and everything. So it's doing really good. And the battery comes out, you see there's like a little uh, key that comes with it. So you can take your battery out of it and take it inside to charge it. And it also helps as a little safety feature so people can't run off with it as right. easily. Well, we're getting ready to go up to the lake. The sun's still not out yet, but it's supposed to come out in just a little bit. So we left our solar panels all hooked up. We got them plugged into our little generator. And uh, what we're gonna do is let it charge up. And then tonight when we get back, we can just take this inside and we'll take our battery and charge it up. And this will charge our battery up about two times if we have it fully topped off. So that, that's gonna be super nice if we go to the lake or camping out somewhere where there's not power we'll still be able to recharge it. But the bike is, it's supposed to, if you have it on the one assist, it goes, it's supposed to go over a hundred miles. <laughs> Indy. Indy's trying to help. <laughs> Good job, Indy. You're blocking everything. I'll just stand up. So like I was trying to explain with Indy's help, uh, the bike, if you have it on just one assist, on the pedal assist, it's supposed to go almost a hundred miles. So you don't have to recharge it very often. But uh, if you're if you're using it like full blown on seven, or you're using it as a you know without pedaling at all, it'll do over 30 miles. So depending on how heavy you are. But anyway, so you don't have to recharge it like every time you use it. But um, anyway, this this will recharge it a couple times, so you're good to go for as long as you've got some sunshine. Um, you've got free energy. You're gonna have power. Yep. Oh my gosh, that was a big hill. And I know why my wife bought the e-bike <laughs> at our age. Oh. That was rough. Is your heart still beating? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is like having superpowers. You still get some exercise, but <laughs> I feel like you have bionic legs. <laughs> oh no. Come no. on, old, come on, old man. <laughs> you did good though. I didn't know you my, still had my it. My legs were burning. I didn't know you still had it in you. <laughs> Your old thighs.
was fun. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. That goes all t on the road and off the road. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> I know, I like it. I can go everywhere on it. You can make it do things I can't, though. <laughs> I used motocross. <laughs> Pretty fun. That is. That's a good little bike. That's a pretty spot, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Get nicer out. Let's see. Sun came out finally today. It's really nice out. I'm gonna burn some rubber. <laughs> I'm still just a big kid. This is fun. You have your bugs in your I teeth? I sure wish I had this when I was coming up that hill. <laughs> yeah, I bet you do. <laughs> My legs feel so much better. <laughs> well, guys, what we're planning on doing is uh, bringing our camper and really kind of show how good these are when you're at a campsite. You can ride them over to the little grocery store over here or you don't have to get in your car. Yeah, and you can drive around and see the scenery. It was sure pretty. Yeah. So they're really handy. This thing is super fun. I've been having a blast. Coming down that hill was crazy. It handles really well because it's kind of got a low center of gravity. The seat's not adjustable, but it's a perfect height for me and it's super comfortable. But like for Lance, he's 6'1". If he was gonna do a lot of uh, pedaling or off-road pedaling, he probably might want one of their bigger bikes that has an adjustable seat for his long, long elephant, I mean long legs. <laughs> giraffe legs not elephants but anyway I, what i really like about it is i i like riding the bike and getting some exercise and this has the pedal assist is just right here so it's super easy up or down so if you know if you're going up a super steep hill you can just very easily turn it up and then turn it back down when you want to do some pedaling and get some exercise and it goes all the way from zero to seven. And if you, it also has a shifter that has seven gears. And that is also nice and it works really well. And then it has a throttle right here. You can push this button and just ride it like a scooter with uh, without even pedaling if you want. So it's pretty cool, really like it. Overlook. 
Oh, that beautiful? Is that beautiful or what? Yep, it's beautiful. <laughs>